have a chicken foot. Did I say that right? Chicken feet. Chicken feet. Kanika. Chicken feet. <sighs> Hi guys, good morning. Welcome back to my channel. Hope you guys are having yourself a blessed and wonderful day. It's the weekend. It is the last day of September. Wait, 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 wait. 30 days in September, April, June, and November. 31 in all the other days except February. Where there's 28 days and 29 in the leap year. Listen, I never forgot that. So, yeah, today's the last day of September. And we have a few hours to be killing it in October. I fell off of making videos at the end of September because, you know, I... I I'm going to school and it's like, yo, I'm telling you, don't ever fall back on school because you know it's going to be hard to catch up. So that was what I was doing. I was catching up because I just got demotivated at the end of September for whatever reason. But now I'm back. I'm back and I'm bubbling. So I'm hoping that you yourself are having yourself a great September 30th and you are ready for October and you're about to kill it because listen it's 2023 we have three months left three months you see how you see how life is September is done and we only have three months left in 2023 listen it's not over till it's over it is not over till it's over and I have a goal before December 31st and I'm gonna make it I'm gonna make it, I'm gonna write it down in my journal today. My goal for the next three months is to save some money. Save some money, don't ask me where it's coming from, but listen, manifestation is real. You heard me? <laughs> Try it, it works. Um, so it's, my goal is to save some money by the end of this year. And I will let you go. I won't tell you the dollar value of what I'm trying to, to save. But listen, write it down. Whatever you're trying to do, write it down and it'll happen. Work, write it down and work towards it. Because you can't just write it down and not put no work in. So write it down and work towards it. So save some money. And I'm also trying to get some more subscribers before the end of this year. I, that I can tell you. I'm trying to get... 300 i'm 10 less than 300 so hopefully i need to get to 500 really but um i'm only hoping for 300 if i get more it's a bonus all right so today i'm not really doing much i'm going grocery shopping to get items for to make a, a pot of soup i haven't had chicken soup in a while i already have the chicken foot i have the chicken foot did I say that right? Chicken feet. Chicken feet. Kanika. Chicken feet. <sighs> so yes, guys. So I was saying I don't have any chicken. So I am going to... What's up with my shirt? Can you wash these clothes? They just... Focus. 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 So... I don't have any chicken, so I'm going into the supermarket to pick up some chicken. It's a Caribbean supermarket, so I'm going to um. Let me show you some of the stuff that they have. They have Jamaican stuff, Caribbean stuff in there. Um, let me show you some stuff that we get here that's only sold in Jamaica, and a lot of states don't even have these. So if y'all want some of these Jamaican goodies and you live up here, I'll mail them out for you. So you don't have to get it from Jamaica. You can get it from here. So I'm going to be making that video when I go inside. Carib things you can get in the Caribbean store here. It's called um, Tropical Fresh. That's the name of the store that I'm going into. So I'll show you some of the stuff that you can get here. So if you want some Jamaica stuff, you live in America, hit me up. You can cash at me. You could cash at me the money and I'll mail you out your box, okay? So let me know because there, like I said, there's stuff you can get in New York that you can't get in other states. So I will show you a bit of what they have. Hit me up. 
This is the best curry yet. The best. Not sure why it's saying it's 19.29. What the hell? Wait, maybe it's the big one. <laughs> maybe it's this one. This one is the big one. This is the 15.88 ounces, but it is 19.29. A tad expensive, but it's the best curry ever. And then you have all the seasonings here, different types of Caribbean spices. Um, I used to buy Blue Mountain, but I have bought it in a, in a minute now. You have the Maggie seasoning. You have the little sachets. Look at this curry paste. Who like porridge? I like that in your porridge, rose water. All the flavoring. And down here is the Aki and Brian. And these are the Kaolu. Easy spice. Fish seasoning. They, they're making curry powder now. I didn't know that. And you have the oxtail seasoning. That's really good. Yeah. Pork seasoning. And I believe they have the all-purpose Okay, let's see this one is the same oxtail this is the barbecue i never knew that they had barbecue seasoning though and you can't leave out the coconut milk and they have the grace coconut milk coming down here is the bigger vanilla right Bina, you know when i was younger i used to drink this a lot maybe i need to buy one more one today right Bina. it's coconut syrup different types of syrup my favorite is sitting over there pineapple orange and then up here you have different kinds of punches peanut punch um, this is surge oh Alex loves surge but not peanut punch he likes the regular milk have different types of coconut um, coconut bricks to the coconut bricks and then you have the different juices this is at the bottom here. So this is just one aisle of, um, I guess this is another Jamaican aisle right here. I never tried this one before. It's um, Gillette, Gillette Aki. Never tried it before. Look what we have over here. Aisle. And there's one thing that we like. And one other thing right there. This is the big one for $5.99. Alright. I'm getting three of these because they are delicious. The smaller ones are over here. And they're they're four for five dollars. These are the original ones. The original ones, and they also have the green ones. The hot ones. So. And the sardines, is the regular. You know, they have this one, the Vienna sausages. I'm not sure where those are. But, um, somebody, oh, they're up here. This one for $1.49. And there's a bunch of like tea stuff tea stuff let me see if i can find the ones we are used to um no i'm going to the bread section now These are the Jamaican yellow yams for a whopping $5.99 a pound. These definitely raised, but guys, I don't know how to buy yams. I 
I've been buying yam for so many years and I don't know, still don't know how to buy it. I wonder if this is a good piece. I feel like the bottom of it is gonna be bitter, but at least I have, you know, decent size. Or, no, this, this is definitely the bottom of the yam. Um, what about this piece? I don't know. I don't know about that one either. I see this. I don't know why they cut them either. Look, this I know usually the bottom down here, if you buy it like that, they're gonna be very bitter. Which piece do I get? Here's another piece that's like cut. I don't know, somebody must have cut it. I wonder if this is good. They cut, they cut the, maybe they cut the bad piece off. I don't know, I think I'm gonna get this piece. What do you think about this? No? No? Try it on that piece. Yeah, but what do you think about it? Is it good or no good? That's cut? Yeah. The, it's... Guys, I don't know. I'm not, I never bought yam. Like, I, just, I mean, I, even if I get it, they're always good. So we're gonna get that. Um, I already have potatoes. Um, so Landers in different colors, guys. I, I never, I don't really eat them. They have that one. They have this one. I don't know what this one is. This looks like cassava. Yes, cassava. Cassava chips. Just the plant in. Which one is this? Dasheen chips. Oh shit. I don't know. I didn't even know they had those. And you know my favorite. My favorite is this. It's, it's, it's called ticket. And then there's that one. So I think, oh, you know what? Maybe I need to get some of these. Some of these for the soup. Do you put these in soup? What is it called? I think they call it cocoa in Jamaica, but I think I'm gonna go get some. Is this cocoa though? I don't even know. They call it white yentia. Let me just grab some, just in case. Mm -mm. I'm just gonna get four, just for um. What else do I need in the soup? Do I have flour? I think I have flour. Chocho? We didn't get there yet. Guys, we have chocho. Like, seriously, we have chocho. How many chocho do I need for this soup now? Two? I'm getting two. How do you know when chocho is? How do you know when it's um ready? Like... It's, they always look like this and it's, they're always tough so I don't know oh we gotta go to the back to get chicken it's gonna be a bad soup today no man bad soup big bad soup heron red heron um, it's 624 red heron saltfish Three, three ninety one for this pack. They call it a whole different name than what we know it as. We call it salted gas. See, but we call it sawfish. It's cheap today. Like usually, it's like thirteen dollars, nine dollars, but it's it's relatively cheap. And this one down here is four something, so it's not bad. It's really not bad. Alright, I'm gonna go. The chicken is over here. Chicken is over here. Like I said, I already have chicken foot. Oh, but I don't have any. I don't have the cut up ones. These are different. This is a brand called Angel Brand. We have Cerise. Um, what else we have? We have thyme sticks, bay leaf, nutmegs, nutmegs. Um, moringa leaves. I don't know what these are. Sour sap leaves. Um, 
Look at that. Shay and your oats. Um, what else they have? I don't know what this is. It's, I don't know what that is. I'm gonna have to look it up. Irish mosh. I don't know what those are. Oh, Sarsa Perla. I always heard about that in Jamaica. Um, you have Jamaican peppermint. And a good, good busy. Busy, busy, busy. Um, fennel seeds. Linseed. You know, all of what we use back home is in here. So guys, this is the soup behind me. I just put everything in there. I have a huge problem. I always end up putting either too much meat or too much food and then don't have space to put anything else. So I haven't put any um, noodles in there yet or, you know, seasoned it properly. But this is what's going on so far with the stuff I bought at the store today to make this soup. So once it's done, I'll show you guys what it looks like.